As said previously in the course, agents can change channels at any given moment. And in this case, Heidi will generate a call link and send it to David to start the video call. Heidi will choose Generate Call Link and then press Send. And this is it. David can click on this link in his conversation window and connect with Heidi who can guide him through the specifications of headphones and help him with the decision. Agents can choose from various options here, such as mute, turn the camera on or off, sharing the screen, transfer, hold, or they can even change the mic, speakers or camera settings. After the call is ended, Heidi still has some wrap-up time that was predefined by Massimo, the supervisor. This gives Heidi time to make some updates or notes if needed. Also, if Heidi needs more time, she can just press plus 10 seconds until she reaches the time she wants to wrap it up. After Heidi is done with the call and wrap-up, she can select finish and close. As you can see, the channel has now changed. WhatsApp is no longer displayed as the channel of communication because we had a video call and this conversation is automatically closed. If we want to go back to the old conversation, we just need to navigate to the left-hand side and choose the conversation with the WhatsApp logo. Since David and Heidi resolved everything on the call, Heidi can now change the status of the conversation from open to closed. And with that, the conversation will be closed, disappear from my work panel and will be moved to all work panel, history section. In case Massimo, as the supervisor, wants to see the conversation, he can do so in the history section.